it wouldn't be me if I didn't find the food, right? So I'm here <laughs> cooking in this little kitchen. We have some carrots, some pasta going over here. And Ms. Jerry hopes in the future she'll teach kids, say, about cooking or restaurants on the bus and then actually bring them to one where they can learn hands-on in person. And that's what she hopes to do with this mobile classroom. We love Miss Jerry. We love Miss Jerry so much. That's what it takes, just <laughs> one teacher with a little bit of Talk about the pandemic pivot, as you pointed out, you know, throughout the last year. It's inspiring. It's extraordinary, right? It's just one person can make such a difference just by carrying no and doubt. doing it their no own doubt. way. So how often does Miss Jerry uh, meet with her students? So she has a few classes that meet twice a week for two hours each where they do some mixing of learning in the bus and outside of the bus. Each class has about two to six students, so much smaller. And in Miss Jerry's case, she thinks it's much safer than going to a traditional classroom right now where there may be 20-plus students. It is phenomenal. That's Love right. this. This it is sure a is. good pivot. And also, we expect nothing less <laughs> than for you to find food. Okay? So way to go. You got to represent wherever you go, my friend. Running on empty, my friend. Oh, my pasta, oh, ravioli. <laughs> Do you remember those days? Well, you don't, know, but my child when she used to play with all that stuff, so cool. Beautiful. Thanks, Jada. Yeah. yeah.